Hi, this is Ivan with Simple Sheets. In this video, we're going to do a step-by-step -step tutorial of our objectives and key results template. This is one of over 100 pre-built and smart templates that we offer. Click the link in the description and try 5 free templates before you buy. Let's get started. The introduction sheet contains a short description about this template. Over here, we have a customization difficulty, an explanation of the sheets that come with this template, and some instructions on how you can utilize this template. It's important for every organization to align their actions throughout the year with their planned objectives. One way to gauge whether you've achieved those objectives is by looking at the key results. We start in the Objectives database sheet. It's here where we can set the different parameters such as the departments or areas, objectives list, involved members, as well as your boundaries for the visualizations. Once everything's there, we can go to the Objectives and Key Results sheet. In the lower left area, you input the different objectives that your company has set, input area or department, the person in charge, the objective, a description, and a number target. In the lower right portion, we have the area to put the monthly target as well as the result after the month has ended. The progress percentages and gross percentages are computed automatically, so don't input any data in these cells. At the far right, we have a max percentage, which is the percentage of the month with the most output against the target that you set for that objective. On the top portion, we have some charts to help show you how on track you are with your objectives. It gives you a chart on your objective progress versus the overall progress achieved. A chart that shows the different departments and their progress percentages. Lastly, we have a graph showing the objective progress achieved over the months. All the charts could be changed using the dynamic slicers on the left hand side. You could filter by area or department, objective, or the person in charge. We have a refresh macro button here that you could press to update your charts when you input new data and a full screen macro button which hides the ribbon when pressed. If you want to have those back, just minimize the window and they should be right back. That's all for this template. If you want to automate your Excel processes and enhance your level of productivity, Simple Sheets Advanced Templates and University is the best tool out there. I'll see you guys on the next one.